Hey, Rick Wallace here. And today we're going to talk about using hardscaping in your garden. And uh, I'm not a big fan of uh, stone, you know, block retaining walls. I think, you know, they serve a purpose to add function, you know, make your yard more usable. But a lot of times I don't feel like they add any aesthetic value to your landscape. So what we've been doing this year, we've, we've been experimenting with, uh, with boulder walls. And you can see the one behind me. Not only is it creating a flat area down here near the boat dock, but it's also really, really pretty. And it just makes it a more, uh, a, you know, makes it, it, this landscape looks natural. It looks like it belongs here. It looks like it's part of Georgia. So, you know, this is a great alternative to, to just a, a boring Allen block wall or just a, a really a rigid looking wall you can actually add a lot of aesthetic value with these boulder walls and as you can see behind me we've got some some sedum planted in the cracks it's just going to soften that wall a little bit we've got this tiff tough permuta that's just this, this really bright dark green that that really enhances the wall sets it off even more and then we like to use these step treads that you can see this one going up up the yard here and they're just uh, I think this one's about a three foot by 18 inch wide by six to eight inch uh, tall step and it's just a it's, it's a really beautiful looking step and we install these a lot of times they, they the, the material is expensive but the labor to put them in is less so it's almost like it balances each other balance it, it balances each other out because you get a really good looking step but you're not paying all the all the labor to form up a step, you know, pouring concrete, that kind of thing. And the end product is really, really pretty. And we also filled this hill in. I mean, we're our all of our clients say they want really low maintenance landscapes. And you know, we planted this muley grass behind us that will virtually require no pruning. And it gets about four to five foot wide. And eventually this hill. Behind me, it's covered in muley grass. It will require no pruning, and eventually will require very little pine straw as well. So it's a great low maintenance option. That, and the muley grass kind of ties into this stone wall as well. It kind of gives it that natural uh, kind of look. So if you're if you're thinking about hardscaping, you know we we think you know we really like to use natural natural stone, and uh, and the cost isn't that much more by the time we save a little bit on labor using this natural stone. But not only does it provide function, it provides a lot of aesthetic value. I mean, this this wall behind us, I was really proud how this turned out. One of our foreman valley. Uh, ran this job and he fitted every one of these stones in there and it just turned out really good. So thanks for watching.